Hey there, welcome back to our channel. Today we have something fantastic in store for all you content creators, bloggers, and business owners. We'll show you how to create an email newsletter in WordPress for free and add a subscription form with multiple fields, lists, and custom fields. We're about to unveil a fantastic plugin that will make your email marketing journey headache free. It's called the Newsletter Plugin by Stefan Alyssa. The link to download this amazing plugin is in the video description below. First things first, navigate to your WordPress plugin settings and install the plugin. Next, go to the plugin settings and create lists for subscription forms. Lists are very useful to target subscribers when you send a newsletter or to associate special services. You can also create custom fields and display them on the forms. From the subscription form settings, you can select form fields, assign lists and custom fields, and finally, display the form on your website using short codes. Short codes are an essential and very versatile feature of the newsletter plugin, as they allow users to insert subscription forms into landing pages, widgets, and posts. From this tab, you can change various settings related to subscription forms, such as changing notification messages, etc. Here, you can create multiple newsletter templates and assign them to different lists of subscribers. You can also select pre-made templates. Its drag and drop builder is amazing and easy to customize.
From these settings, you can select different lists. Leaving all the multiple choice options unselected is equivalent to selecting all of them. You can send the newsletter right now or schedule the sending at a specific time. With the pro version, you will get extra options for sending newsletters like automated emails. So there you have it, creating an email newsletter in WordPress for free using the newsletter plugin. One more thing that I forgot to mention is that there is a minimalist version of the subscription form, which displays the email field and a submit button. You can use this short code to display the form on your website and customize its styling using CSS. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to click that subscribe button for more fantastic WordPress tutorials. If you have any questions or need assistance, leave a comment below. We're here to help. That's it for today. See you in the next video.